Hey, and welcome to this video from Joomla Shack. I'm going to show you how to add a countdown clock extension to your Joomla site. This will allow you to count down to your birthday, to an event, to a celebration, to any event that's coming up. OS Timer has been around for many years now, and one of the best experiences I've had as a Joomla developer is actually seeing it live on a site which was counting down to the launch of a whole new country. That was the official website of that new country. So OS Timer can be trusted and works really well. It's a module, which means it will appear in the sidebar or one of the areas on the top or bottom of your site. Once you have OS Timer installed on your site, go to Extensions and Modules, and you're going to want to create a new module. I'm going to click the New button on this page and choose OS Timer. And then you can start to think about the event you're going to count down to. In this instance, I'm a big football slash soccer fan. And I know there's a big soccer game coming up on June 1st this year. So my title for my module can be soccer game. Um, I like soccer, but I live in the US. So I'm using the US version of the name soccer. And I can look down at the options here. If I want to, I can choose an image to go with the event. I can choose the event title. The event title is going to be Big Soccer Game. And do I want to display the event date? Yes, I do. I'm going to set that to yes. The date format, I have a few options. I think it might be useful in this case for people to know that it's on a Saturday or a Sunday. And the date itself is going to be June 1st. And the game is going to be at, say, 3 p.m. So I'm going to put that in European military time. So that'll be 15 for 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I can configure other things such as the, the time format if I want to. And in the position, I can choose where on the site this countdown module is going to appear. In this case, I'm going to choose position 7, which happens to be an easy position to see on the template that I'm using. Uh, I'm going to show this on all the pages. And the Layout tab is interesting. This Layout tab has all sorts of options for controlling the look and the feel of your countdown. I'm not going to change them for now, but I might come back again in a minute once we see what our module looks like on the front of the site. So I'm going to click on Save to make sure that my new module is saved. And if I go to the front of the site, on the right-hand side, I can see that I have an active countdown in action there on the right-hand side of the site. This is the default layout, but particularly if you have the pro version of OS Timer, it's possible to make it look pretty different. That is done under the Layout tab. For example, there is a minimal theme. That's what the minimal option looks like. It looks better already. There's a set off theme. And set off looks pretty similar to minimal, just with some rounded corners. And there's a source theme as well which adds a different colored header for the title and the date itself. And inside here, you can decide whether you want the hours or the minutes to show. You can configure some JavaScript and CSS effects, and you can also change the color. If you wanted to change your event to be bright green, you can do that in here. Let's see what our bright green event looks like. Okay, <laughs> that's pretty garish, but you get the idea. OS Timer is highly customizable. And if you have an event, a birthday, a celebration, a party, anything like that that's coming up, and you want to tell people on your website that it is coming up, they should attend, I recommend using OS Timer. It will give you a big, bright countdown so that anyone who visits your site knows that you have an important event coming up soon.